It is a magical place underground. It's Nashville's newest hotspot. It's the house of cards where fine dining and magic come to life. On 3rd Avenue, the Johnny Cash Museum. Cash's exhibit on the first floor, Patsy Cline above, and below, the House of Cards. Bill Miller, the Nashville man who brought this basement below Broadway back to life. So there's no signage, and you'll never hear me say ever again, mark your words, that I don't want to sign. But for this enterprise here, we don't want to sign. We want people to have to get here and find it. Once guests make it down this secret tunnel, that's when the magic really begins. I would just describe it as, as being able to escape everyday life. You know, leave your troubles behind. It's all about fantasy. We offer fantasy here, so for those two hours or three hours or four hours, however long you decide to come here, forget about everything. Forget about troubles, forget about work. Come here and experience and live this world of magic. A world with a secret dining room, a main stage that'll blow you away with four magic shows a night, all oh the my way. gosh! Kara, lift, look underneath, what do you see? There's nothing here. Exactly. And world-class magicians wowing you up close in the dining room all night long. Watch this, I'm going to make those cards change places. But what's interesting is that somehow I end up ah! with the two red aces. Turn those over, you're holding the two black what? aces. I know, right? Walk around and you never know what you might see or look as hard as you like, and you still can't figure out how they do it. Could you play Beethoven? But know this, before you enter, there is a dress code. Ladies, cocktail attire or pantsuit, men, button down and sport coat. Once you enter those doors, you're in a different world. You're in a different time. You're in a time when people dressed up and everything around you is special. Antiques from around the globe. The world's largest collection of vintage cards. Uh, we actually have a Native American card which was hand done on buffalo hide. We were able to go out and, and reach back to the first playing card that was ever, and it comes to us from Germany from the year 1490. And it's a suit that no longer exists. It's the 10 of leaves. And the walls, ah, oh, the walls, covered with advertisements for magic shows from the early 1900s, all of them originals. This is the real thing, and this is what got people to show up for a show, and it's, it's right here in the theater. A theater that showcases the best in magic, and can you believe they live here? Nashville is home to a number of world-class magicians. They were as thrilled to discover this venue as we were to discover them. Once you discover this place, you really will believe in magic. What we encourage the most is grab your cocktail, walk around, spend the entire evening here, enjoy the magic, because once you're here, there's no extra charge for magic. We have magicians on the floor at all times, and we have four shows a night in the showroom, which are, which are our stage shows. So it's, it's an evening. Plan on spending a few hours and plan on having the time of your life. And clearly Nashville folks are believers because it's already won the Diner's Choice Award for the year. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? I know. Pretty incredible. So House of Cards, it opens at 5 to midnight. Reservations for a table, highly recommended. Yes. But you can just go in to the bar and right. sit down. But remember the dress code. Yes. We went it's uh, mandatory. opening week and I kind of didn't tell Paul about the dress code. But it was fine. It was fine. Why was it fine? Because... They have a jacket there for him to borrow. They have yes. jackets to borrow. So, and that yes. was totally my fault. Also, <laughs> we talked about this earlier. That's the most you will ever see of any photography in that place because there are no photos allowed, no selfies, house of cards. It's under the Johnny Cash Museum on 3rd Avenue. Highly recommended. Definitely. We, we're going to go. Would, Date night. I'd love to yes, go. We're that doing it. so fun.